you know those weird habits that you have or the hobbies that you don't really talk about or the things that you stand for and the things that you stand against or your beliefs right your values the things that you don't really talk about that much or you kind of keep compartmentalized from your business those are actually the things that are going to attract the best referral partners and attract the best clients. You know, if you think about your referral partners that you're working with today, think about your real estate agents, your insurance agent, your title person, some of them you probably don't like talking to. You ignore their phone calls, you wait a long time to respond to texts, you very hesitantly meet up with them in person because you feel like if you don't, it's gonna impact your relationship, but you don't do it out of joy and happiness because you enjoy a friendship with them. You do it because they make you money. But talking about those weird parts, your hobbies, the things that you do in your off time, your things that you stand for and against, your beliefs, your values, those are all the things that are gonna attract the very best people to be around you, right? Because they're already gonna be similar to you. You're gonna like them the most. You guys are gonna have things in common. You can go out and do things recreationally and for fun outside of work where you don't just have a work relationship, but you actually have a real friendship. But the only way friendships can build, you know, you need some sort of common ground and oftentimes money is not enough of a common ground to actually build a partnership and become, you know, become actually friends. It just is always going to be a business relationship. So think about talking about those weird bits a little more often, right? The things that you're doing when you're not working, the things that you believe in, your values, your things you stand for and against, right? All that kind of stuff. Um, the little quirkiness, the little quirky things about you that make you super unique to who you are. Make sure you talk about that stuff sometimes and bring that stuff out into the light because that's what's going to push losers away that would not be into the same stuff that you're into or that are offended or any of that kind of stuff by something that you do. It's going to pull other people closer to you that are going to like you more because now they know that about you, right? And ultimately, we have to make people feel some kind of way about us in order to have any chance at all to get their business. And in order for some people to like us because we're talking about our guns or hunting or fishing or grilling steaks or whatever the thing is for you, that's going to have the opportunity to offend somebody, right? I mean, some like bleeding heart vegetarian or whatever vegan person that only drives a Prius, they might be offended. And so they're going to be like, you know what? I'm just going to disconnect from this person because I wouldn't do business with them anyways. And that's a great thing for you. Just weed those people out by talking about who you actually are. And you'll attract other people that are more committed to working with you and like you more because now they know those things about you. So the weird bits, the weird parts, the stuff that you keep secret and hidden from people, that's what's going to actually attract the best people in your life. So give that a shot. Make sure to hit that subscribe button, hit the bell so you get notified when I put out new videos. We'll see you guys next time.